Actinic keratoses are precancerous skin changes that occur on sun exposed areas. They're more common in light, fair, fair skinned people. They'll usually start coming on around your 30s and 40s and they become more frequent with age. They've got about a 20% chance of turning into a skin, sam skin cancer, squamous cell carcinoma. So it's a good idea to, to recognize them early. If you look at the way they, they appear, they're integrated into the skin. They're a, a patch, a red patch that just doesn't want to heal. They'll often start to get a uh, scaliness to them and they'll become irritated and they'll start to get thicker and they can advance into the point where they will actually start to dig into the skin. We want to get them way before that point because that's usually when they've developed into a uh, skin cancer. Now a lot of people will say, well, how can I tell the difference between just a, a regular um, dry skin area and uh, or a, a skin change that's just from aging of the skin? Well, if you look at the other big aging skin spot. They're, they're, they're called seborrheic uh, dermatitis, and they have more of a stuck-on appearance. If you look here, you can see how they look like they've just kind of been stuck on to the skin as opposed to being woven into the, into the skin themselves. So there's quite a big difference between a seborrheic keratosis and an actinic keratosis. If you have a question in your mind about whether or not it's a, it's a skin cancer or a precancerous change, it's a good idea to get in to see your doctor because these can be treated with freezing, there's special creams that can be used, and there's phototherapy, all of which can prevent these actinic keratoses from turning into skin, skin cancers. Of course, avoiding them is the best uh, plan, staying out of the sun between 10 and 2 wearing SPF 30 or greater sunscreen, wearing broad-brimmed hat and protective clothing, and then of course staying out of out of tanning booths which really have a tendency to, to damage the skin. So be, be careful with your skin. If you have any of these uh, spots or changes occur, be sure and get in and see your doctor. That's a minute for health.